Wow. 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 Here we are. How is everyone doing? 69 viewers, a 420 stream, and my first time attempting a music stream. Lots going on. What kind of coffee do you have? This is a Starbucks caramel macchiato. We love to see it. My second, my second coffee drink today. My third, actually. I'm a, I'm a caffeine junkie. This is going to be a really good stream to sort of have on in the background, I think. Oh, gosh. Ah, uh, no. Oh, no. Nice. Okay. So I've never done this before. Did everyone hear that? Did, is this working? Okay, great. So, we're in the little music mode now. Uh, I have a song. Sam and I were kind of working on this melody last night while we were watching Marvel movies. I came up with something. I was playing on the guitar for two seconds. She was like, Ryan, put that guitar down. We have to finish Ant-Man and Wasp. And I was like, Ant-Man and Wasp can It's so bad. Listen to this sicky guitar riff. <laughs> I played it. You can see up here, it's in B minor, 4-4. I had it at 105 BPM, that's the click. I turned it up to 106, which is very minute and stupid, but I did. The the song that we wrote, I mean, the melody that we wrote, I, I don't even remember it, it's somewhere in my, in my notes, but the chords were basically just B minor, D. I just kind of wanted to build a track out of nothing, you know, and just sort of get your guys' feedback as I'm going. Can you do the Wii song? Da -da 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 -da. Oh my god. There it is. No more stupid shit. It's time to focus. I haven't done anything. It's an empty work table. I want something sort of like glitchy and clappy. Uh, I have Splice open. I love Splice. Everyone loves Splice. Also, like, none of the production that I'm going to do today is going to be, like, stat. I'm just going to be doing very basic production. I'll probably do some replacements and stuff like that. But I do just want to clue you guys in for, like, the super music nerd fans, uh, if I have any of those. The grand, like, idea, my big plot. Sort of stream the production process. On my YouTube channel, I'm going to sort of edit and tape the engineering process. Just do it! Make your dreams come true! Very good. Who did that? That's very, very funny. Who just did that? Inspiration Daddy LaBeouf. Thank you, Alexis. Appreciate that. I needed that. Um, and so, you know, if I'm engineering over there and giving that as sort of YouTube content, produ producing over here, making that Twitch content, I'm sort of going to be able to give you, like, a, an actual holistic view of how my music gets made live and in person, or for the stuff that takes longer and is less fun to watch, I'll still be sort of putting that as as a niche kind of thing on my YouTube channel for those who care. But I've been I've been so obsessed with this idea of showcasing my songwriting process because I feel that I'm unique in the sense that I do do all of this myself, um, and I really want the people who I make music for to have a voice in how the music gets made um, because you're you're not just like fans. A lot of you are really smart and have great taste. Obviously you do, you listen to me. So, so I want to include you in it. Um, so that's kind of my, my grand master plan. But anyway, this track, based on the idea that Sam and I came up with last night, I just kind of want to make it sort of lousy, sort of bazzy-ish uh very stripped down i'm thinking sort of like a drum lead in with glitchy claps you know sort of offbeat bells or mallets a lot of like exhale vocal processing i'll show you what that is it's a um native instruments library that i use a lot that's really quite good um so i'm gonna start hunting for this kind of like glitchy drum idea that i had 
all of these drums will probably re be replaced or edited. This is just sort of the bare bones of production that I wanted to show you guys. So I'm going to look for samples between the 100 and 110 BPM range because I'm coming in at 106. I'm probably just going to make this easy, look for a loop. I also, do, this might scream at you. I don't know how loud this is going to be. Not bad. Okay, great. I'm actually obsessed with this. It's coming in at 110 BPM. So you can see it's just, it's, this is gonna be the score mark for eight bars and it's just, it's a little slow. So I'm just gonna stretch that to fit where I want it to. So this just takes the target level of the entire sound down to negative 14 dBs and that's a great place for sound to hit whenever you run it through plugins and stuff. Um, so I just like to do that. Some reason I wanna play with a six, bar intro, I never do that, so I thought it could be fun. So then we'd start here. Two, three, four. I want this to be sort of like an offbeat mallet. So I'm gonna look at these mallet sounds here. Okay, so I like that. We probably just want to layer it up with something else. This is working for me so far. Well, that's lit. can honestly kind of leave that there for a second. I just want to beef up the percussion a little bit. It's nothing all that serious, I just like the idea of claps. Here we go, okay. I don't know, what do you think about making the claps... It, wetness is what the reverb is called. What do you think about making them wet like that? Is it cool with the reverb, or is it better with them really dry? Oh, we like wet? So what do you think about that? That's like, that's like wet, it, that has the wetness, but it's, um, it's in like a smaller room instead of like a big church or a big chamber. What do you think about that? Hey guys, just got out of a little meeting. Um, how's it going? I'm only gonna stay for like two seconds. I love you guys. Oh, look at all the Baileys in the chat. Look at all the Baileys in our hands. There could be something cool with gatekeeping this. Yeah, we're changing these drum space, puppy. Don't you worry about a thing. Bringing up that Valhalla again. Making these claps brighter. Love that so much more. I'm gonna make this spooky as That's cool. I have a cooler idea. Wait, I have a way cooler idea than this. How do I do it though? Huh, this is gonna be a challenge. Might be able to automate this question mark? I think it's just this. Oh. Hold on now. Ooh. 
wait, I'm obsessed with this. I'm trying to get to edit this down so that it becomes a little bit more choppy. We're getting there. We're really getting there. So now I just want to copy this information. Oh, nice. I did it. This is a, a, a new computer and I'm just making a lot of um, sort of complicated moves. with like new commands and stuff. I'm still wondering about this. better I think we're gonna say that that's the track for now it's gonna get trippy for a second wait for it oh my god so many Ryans okay uh we're gonna we're gonna say that that's um the track for now I definitely have to do another one of these because I thought that I was gonna like get much farther I, I sort of planned on finishing the track in two hours but we had a lot of other things to talk about um but yep I gotta go it's gym time gotta go get swall you know me, just best body in Hollywood. Uh, this was a blast. Thank you for spending your 420 with me. Uh, next time, I will be a lot more focused for a lot of reasons. But um, that was that was a, a, a small glimpse kind of into the producing process. So right now, I'm not focusing so much on different, on soundscaping as much as I am just getting the sounds in order where they need to be creating the track. And then I'll, I'll sort of make it all sound dope later and I'm gonna show you that experience as well. Uh, but I appreciate you all so much. Thank you all so much for being here. I've had a great time. And uh, be safe, have a fantastic day. Much love, see you later.